The LAPD SWAT officers were on the roof of a downtown LA high rise this morning. Assignment manager Mark Lewis at the desk where we've been monitoring the police scanners now as the story is developing. Mark, what do we know? Well, yeah, this was a SWAT operation that took most of the morning, but it sounds like LAPD did take one person into custody they were looking for, but one other person is still on the loose. Let me show you some video of what it looked like just a little while ago. We can now show you these pictures. This is video from SkyCal. Those are SWAT officers on the roof of a downtown high rise at 7th and Spring. LAPD narcotics officers responded here this morning to serve a search warrant looking for a suspect who was wanted for illegal guns and narcotics. Now, when they arrived, that suspect did not want to surrender. So that set up a barricade situation. We think on the top floor of this building, you can see that's a sniper team on the opposite building looking in to the, the windows of that building where that suspect was barricaded. Now, they thought they were going to have to make entry into this building in sort of an aggressive way. It turns out later that suspect did surrender and they took him into custody. And when they searched that uh, apartment or business up there, they did find one gun and several narcotics that they were looking for. However, they were looking for another suspect. That suspect is now gone. This was video from our breaking news photographer Dave Gonzalez on the scene. Seventh and Spring was completely shut down while they conducted this operation. You can see LA a Fire Department was on standby also in case they were needed. Turns out they weren't. There were no injuries in this operation, but the scene is now clearing up and the uh, one suspect still on the loose. We will uh, keep following this. I'll bring you the very latest as it becomes available. That is the very latest here from the desk. I'll send it back to you.